Well, hello guys, and welcome back to Cheeky Peak. And today, <laughs> sorry, that's a that's just a fun title to say. Uh, I wasn't really sure what I was going to call this series because it was kind of a it was kind of a vague series where I kind of just play a game once and show you guys what it's like. And it's uh, it's hard to think uh, think of kind of entertaining and catchy names for these shows, but uh, Cheeky Peak was just something that I thought was quite British and kind of rolled off the tongue. So yeah, today we are having a cheeky peek at Assassin's Creed 4. I'm, I've literally just started, I've just picked off up this assassin suit of a fellow, well not a fellow assassin, because I'm a pirate, off a random assassin. I dumped his body somewhere, where is he? I think he was in these bushes. Oh, apparently I've gone down to sniff his corpse. But yeah, we're just going to play, this is literally the opening sequence, so hopefully uh, there's kind of little to no spoilers in here. I've just, I'm looking at this treasure chest on my map, and I don't see it, like right, oh, come on, get off the rock, you climbing pleb, right here, I don't have any spades or anything, I've just got cutlasses, I, don't, I haven't even got any hidden blades, well, we're going to leave that for now, I guess you can't, um, climb up there, you pillock, <laughs> oh god, he's, oh Jesus, he's freaking out. Uh, yeah, I'm right at the beginning, so... Oh, look at that hawk. Oh, God. I scared myself. So, uh, first impressions. Uh, obviously, this is current gen. I probably I will probably be given the PS4 version a little look around. Maybe just a cheeky peek to see how it looks. But right now, this uh, this looks pretty damn nice. Um, not, like, high-resolution texture-wise, but just... Uh, it's a very pleasant environment. I'm liking these greens... And these blues, it's very tropical and exotic, and it's making me... Oh, I forgot to synchronize. Oh. I'll regret that someday. But for now, I don't care. So, I, uh, we are going to a place called Havana. Oh. Free the merchant. Oh, I am a man of the people. Um. Oh, let's jump into here. Let's see if we can do any sneaky stuff. Oh, here we go. Uh, vegetation can use the stalking zones to you hide and move undetected. Okay, so, ah, he just automatically does it. So it looks like I can just walk around and then I can be like, yeah, you are dead in a bush. I'd be a great assassin, I think. My pre-murder quote would be... Oh, oh, ah, 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 ah. Uh, how do I play this stupid game again? Uh, I'm pretty sure you just press V and then you win, right? It, it, oh my fucking god! Oh my god! One thing I have noticed about the Assassin's Creed franchise is it's getting way more brutal. Get that guy! Oh, he shot his friend in the back of the head! Oh my god, did you see that? Oh my god, it's crazy! Um, Christ! As I was, oh, uh, as I was saying, um, one thing I've noticed about the franchise is it gets it's um. It's got much more violent as the game goes on. Uh, the Frank, the the series goes on. Each ep, uh, uh, each game seems to have a more brutal finishing. Sorry if I'm uh, spilling my words all over the place. It is currently 4:22 a.m. right now, so I am uh, I'm a bit bit fatigued, but I'm gonna push through. Uh, I'm unfortunately I'm a bit of a uh, insomniac, but you know, let's not worry about that. Let's listen to what this fat chubby merry guy has to say. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. <laughs> I like this guy. All things considered, I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? I wish people like that were still around in this country. Maybe in a pub somewhere. Lacking a rowboat, I'm afraid we'll have to swim to my ship. Hardly the worst thing to happen. I like swimming. Oh, I'm looking forward. Look at this. This is just great. This f it fills me with a, a kind of joy. Oh, what's the... Oh, hello. Are you okay, chap? I can interact. Oh, I'm oh God, I just molested him. Oh, oh, a treasure map. Oh, exciting. Press something to select the map. Press Y to open them. The coordinates will lead you to a location in the image. Will oh, okay. Let's, let's find our first treasure. Oh, oh. Oh my god! <laughs> it's a turtle! <laughs> what are you doing, turtle? These are endangered species. I was gonna see if I had the option to kill it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
Okay, I am I'm pretty evil. I did try and kill it, but I just I had to see if it was possible. So you Oh, you're going the wrong way too. Never mind. I tried to help you. Okay, so let's uh let's climb up this tree because I feel like being a monkey boy. And then we can run and jump and then the guy will be like, Whoa! Look at that pirate! He's crazy. That's quite a nice ship actually. Ah, it's, it's got a name. Oh, I think there's a name on the back. No, it's not. That's just like an insignia. Well, still, it's pleasant enough. I'm going to be happy to be aboard. Oh. Permission to come aboard, Captain. Oh, I'm, I'm driving, apparently. Jesus. I really make myself a home, don't I? That's okay, I'll just take over your ship, no worries. Uh, hey. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to fall, shall we? God, I'm... He turns a wheel for a very small presses on the analog, analog stick. Aha, here we go. Let's follow this green marker. Ah, there's a tug of the wind in my hair. Ah, I find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean. The raw stink of... of possibility. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. <laughs> I like this, uh, I like this guy here on our right. He is a, he's a merry chap. We've really opened it up now, haven't we? <laughs> oh look, there's little, uh, little, I don't know, they are salmon jumping in the water? Large fish. Very cool. Okay, so let's pick it up the pace, shall we? Oh, 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 we ain't slowing down. Whoa, Jesus, we are picking up speed. Oh god, I report we are picking up a lot of speed. Alright, maintain. You got this, boys. What's that over there? Is that. Slow down. It's flamingos! Ah. Oh shit, are we supposed to be. here? Look at these flamingos. Look at these exotic birds. Wow, I'm really enjoying this setting so far. This is very, uh. Oh, hello! Oh, hi! How you doing, guys? Wow. Cool. Very cool. Oh, a little bit of a bounce. Don't you worry. I've got it. I've got it. Let's speed this thing up again, shall we? This is very relaxing. Oh, Jesus. Do you see the fish? Christ. I'm, I'm, I'm very much enjoying this. It's making me feel quite, quite at peace. Probably because it's 4 a.m. and I'm uh, I'm a bit tired as well, but it's still it's still quite nice. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying myself. I could have some light music on, and I'd be I'd be a probably quite happy chap. <gasps> Come on, tight corner, tight corner. I'm just gonna take my crew out on the on the ocean seas and just whoa, just seek some adventure. Oh look, <gasps> oh my fucking oh Jesus, did you see that? Oh, David Attenborough would be jealous of that. That was fantastic. You're a natural sailor, Duncan. Oh, thanks, I man. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvellous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I... Ah, oh, end of memory. Very oh. promising. Well, who is that? Who is that lady talking to me? Heroes are not born. Uh, yep, every single one is born, actually. That is how they live. All right. Not to be a smart ass. There you go. Welcome back. Well, your numbers look good. Now let's make sure we can break your brain, all right? So where, where am I? Need I need you to move your head and look at these lights. Just oh, okay. Look up. Oh, yep. I can look. I can do that. That's it. Thanks very much. Down. 
Yep. So far, got it. so good. Let's get you up. Thank you for that. I would have been screwed so, about your help. Welcome to the Sample 17 project. Before you get started, you're going to need this. This is an epic looking setup. There you go. I want this in my bedroom. Testing, testing. One, two, three. Hello, bonjour. C'est bon. It works. Well, I want to have a look around that room. All right. Let's take a walk. Ooh. Could you imagine? Just like, look at this. Could you imagine? Just, oh man, this would be so epic. One day, one day I tell you. Oh, what is this weird company? Oh, hello, it's Desmond here. What year is it? Impressive, right? This building is barely six months old. But Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio Crushed. for a few years, since 2010. These are some nice visual displays. It looks reminds me of the Olympics when I was in London. Maybe you saw Liberation? That was our first title powered by Animus Tech. That was just <laughs> the tip of the iceberg. <laughs> what? Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. Did they, they just break the fourth wall? Experiences, of course. Edited versions of real history. But only the exciting parts. And we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature. Caribbean Pirates. So Ooh, that's your gig. Sounds, sounds great. It'll just take a minute, okay? Can I actually go back to playing it instead of walking around in this office? Are you ready? Okay, nice. This is for you. The primary tool of our trade. Your communicator. Hey, an iPad. Power it up and give it a look. It's pretty slick. Oh, she's a lot to take in at once, woman. Well, it's I can't really look at it. It's tiny down you there. You noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because your communicator is your key to getting around. Oh, I don't know why I'm very fascinated by Aqua Life at the moment. <laughs> I'm really enjoying it. I kind of want to. Oh, <gasps> octopus! Oh, I was hoping there was a jump. Just, I want to get in there with the squid and have a dance. Oh, there's Wi-Fi in here. Nice. See that flashing wireless signal? It means you're hooked up to the elevator. I'll let you do the honors. We're headed up to the Sample 17 studio, second floor. How do I? How do I use a stupid gizmo? Why can't I just push the number 17 on the walls? How do I? Oh, here we go. <laughs> God, no idea what's going on. I'm not a fan of this system you have. I'm more of a fan of big buttons on walls. How do I get rid of this? No, oh God. Ready? Let's go. How do I get rid of this? There you go. A. Okay. Ah, there's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Bonjour. Salut, mes amis. Ah, the French are Ubisoft. Have you met our new hire? Just started. Oh no, it's just him. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hey, then, Connor. Edward, the pirate. Ah, ar, yar, maybe. <laughs> this is very, very strange. You're talking about Connor as well from Assassin's Creed 3. Can we talk in your office for a minute? Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in So they've gone from trying to save the world to just making games? I, it's kind of a step so, down in, in the dramatic department. We're diving into the memories of one very Hey, Google. Donor. Everyone knows if we're there's a beanbag in the office, it's Google. And hopefully one day we can <gasps> forge some fantastic hey. experiences from what we find. Are you there. stealing wires down there? Oh, this I caught him. John, one of the wizards in IT. He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing, calibrating. Calibrating, right? So here we are, your very own Animus workstation. I really want to steal all these people's statues because everyone seems to have loads. I mean, you're in the person personality of these different cubicles. This is kind of cool. How are you controlling that with your mind? Jesus. This is better than Google. Okay, where, where am I actually supposed to go? I'm getting distracted. There's just so much to look at. I like looking at everything. Oh, I'm supposed to be in my cubicle. Fucking hell, John, get out of the way. Oh, it's just B. Oh, all those people at the computer were in some sort of animus? 
That's why I wasn't doing anything. He was just he was wired in. Oh god, where the hell are we? Where is this? Assassin's Creed for Black Flag. Cool intro, bros. Well, that might be quite a perfect place to leave it. Uh, I know I haven't shown off much in the game, but that, uh, that's kind of the point. That's kind of the point of this video series. It's just supposed to be a tiny little peek into the game just to kind of tantalize your taste buds in case you guys want to try it out yourself. And this way it doesn't really spo spoil anything because this is literally the opening tutorial I just went through. And uh, meeting that fluffy character. Look at that guy. What a happy chap. Ugh, oh, I can't wait to play and uh, be side by side with him to the end. Hopefully he doesn't die because that, uh, that would hurt me a bit. But uh, yeah, uh, thanks for watching guys. I uh, hope you're kind of enjoying the idea of this series. And uh, there will be more to come.